So I've gotten a couple comments about issues with the quest system in the project files. So when you run up and get the quests, you can basically just auto-complete them. Uh, but that is, let's jump into the quest folder. Just because these don't have any parameters set up. So like the target practice one it has it did have. But the the collectible quest it didn't have anything. So what you'll have to do is just go through and kinda update the parameters as you need. So for the collectibles quest you just need to add what collectible you need and how many. So I'm gonna say I need three of those. For the target practice, instead of doing the dummy, I'm going to change it to the wolf. So I'll change that to the wolf, and I only want to have to kill two. And when you add a kill target, you also need to add a kill count for each kill target that you put in. So let me make sure which one you got. Oh, and uh, to make sure you get the right quest, just compare the quest ID with the... So I want you to have number two and you to have the one you got. Alright. So I'm back these way over here, closer. So I get my quest. Incomplete get this quest not completed come back to you can't auto complete can't auto complete let's jump back in and do it the opposite route just to make sure get that target practice nothing get that one can't finish still not completed let's grab this sword and see if we can complete these quests try to just get the wolves and not the knights. I should have just deleted that spawner, but... Oh well. There we go. Alright, let's run... Oh! Let's grab some of these two. Can we not? Oh, I don't know what that was about, but okay. Let's run back to you, finish that quest, and finish that quest. So it seems to be working. Just make sure if you're having any issues with the quest system that you, uh, check the data table and make sure that all the requirements are set. Uh, one of the other questions was about the enemy spawner and if you had two of them that it kind of messed with each other, but let's get rid of all these. Um, enemies. Characters. Enemies. Enemy spawner. Alright. So apparently if you had two of them with the same enemy spawner it would mess with each other but I'm gonna say five of those I'm gonna make it spawn the knight and then I'm just gonna duplicate it and the only thing I'm gonna alter down is the spawn delay and then when I simulate so it seems to be working this is just because I couldn't get the player reference because I simulated. But, yeah, so I'm not... I'm sorry that I'm not being very helpful on some of these. I just I can't seem to recreate them. But if y'all want to take a look at the project files and see, uh, I'll link where you can download this exact version. This is the cleaned... cleaned project for the one I uploaded to Game Jolt. So if you want to take a look at it, I'll link it in the description box. And uh, yeah, sorry I'm not 
able to help very much, but I will see y'all soon for the next portion of this series. Bye-bye.